dude, I, I really appreciate you talking to me and yeah, I actually feel like a lot better about the whole situation. Oh, it, it's all good, man. He can be <laughs> kind of a wild card, but so can you, you know? I mean, we all can sometimes. That's true. You know what? I don't even really like know your story or anything. Same story as anyone here, honestly. The ego can be a really crazy thing. You spend your whole life thinking you want something and then you get it and realize it didn't fix you. And more than anything, it just complicates everything. I don't know. I don't know if we're wired to be able to handle that. I don't know if I'm even wired. <laughs> You're fine, dude. The whole world thinks they know you when they see you through a screen. That's the weird part. Like, everyone has an opinion, but they've never actually met you in real life. It's so bizarre. It's like they think I'm, like, actually the guy from the movie. But that's all they know. You know what I mean? You can't really blame them. They need to figure that part out. And some of them never will, but that's all good, too. How do you, like, deal with that? These days, I don't. Their mind's already made up about you, dude. <laughs> Stop worrying about the opinions of people who don't think. Now. Oh god, here comes Fred. Who? Huh? It's that guy from the B-52s. B-52s. The Love Shack guy? I think Jeffrey's like a huge fan. Is that a Titanic I see? It's not a Titanic. It's a Titanic lobster. Hey man, what's going on? Everybody has matching towels. Yep. I hope you don't hit an iceberg. Cause then you'll be going down, down, down. Uh, okay. <laughs>